What is going on guys and welcome back to Touchdowns to Home Runs. My name is Bernie. Thank you for joining us today on the Touchdowns to Home Runs show that your July 4th so far is going absolutely fantastic. And if you wanted fireworks on your July 4th weekend, well, you might have just got it because JT Tuomolau, the six foot four and a half, 275 pound defensive lineman, has finally announced his collegiate commitment. And it is to the Ohio State Buckeyes over the Oregon Ducks, USC Trojans, and his in state Washington Huskies. Now, this one was a little bit of a scare, I think, for the Buckeyes. Now, pretty much every expert on 24 7 sports and rivals did have him committing here and that was the consensus for a very long time but it did seem like Oregon was sneaking up in that recruiting process he decided to not take his final visit to Alabama which gave them the final impression um, but overall he's finally locked into Ohio State I think Ohio State fans are going to be really really happy with this massive pickup now According to the 24-7 sports football ranking system, of course, he's rated as a five-star recruit. 24-7 sports also has him ranked as the top-rated recruit in the state of Washington, the best defensive lineman in the class, and they actually have him as the top overall recruit in the recruiting class of 2021. Now, he is a little bit lower on the composite rankings, which means he's a bit lower on some of the other sites as well, ESPN rivals. Um, but again, huge pickup for Ohio State. Ohio State fans should, again, be very, very happy and a little cherry on top he's actually rated as the 24th best recruit of all time on 24 7. now jt in terms of his game he's a powerful athletic defensive lineman in my opinion room to get even stronger on top of the strength and muscle that he already has he's a former elite basketball player um, which translates in terms of some of the athleticism onto the football field he's now an elite pass rusher with good moves at the line and again that big strength and big power allows him to shed his blockers at the line Overall, he's got very good hands, played some safety earlier on in his career, um, has the speed and athleticism to go back in coverage, in my opinion, at some points. Could possibly also play tight end if he ever decided to focus on offense. But for now, I think at the collegiate level, um, Ohio State is really going to like what they're getting in this defensive line prospect. And of course, in my opinion, uh, he's got some potential to be in upper round, upper first round draft pick come the NFL time. But uh, yeah, so for Ohio State, this rounds out a very, very solid 2021 class. Um, currently sit number two, of course, only behind that historic 2021 recruiting class for Alabama. Um, but again, getting Ohio State over Alabama over these other Pac-12 schools, I think is going to be huge for them. Uh, marks their sixth five-star of the class. Uh, goes along with 13 four-star signings as well. But if you guys did make it to this point in the video, let me know your thoughts, your comments on this commitment to Ohio State down in the comment section below. I know it was a long wait, a longly anticipated decision, um, but he finally did make that decision. So if you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure to let me know by smashing that thumbs up button, subscribing to Touchdowns to Home Runs, more content just like this. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you again next time.